U.S. officials announced it would extend the mask mandate for another month. Recently, mask mandates were lifted at the state level, but does not include mask on public transportations. In this video, we talk about the extension of mask mandates. Will this be the last extension of the mandate? But first, we want to thank you for joining us. Find us on all the other social media channels. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click that bell to get notified when we release a new video. We also appreciate your likes and comments below as it helps to support our channel. Oh, and don't forget to check out our website at immigrationandmigration.com. This video is brought to you by I am. We believe that travel improves and inspires you and the people around you. We help you travel by providing services which overcome barriers and frameworks that simplify and enrich your experience. We just happen to be immigration lawyers. So reach out to your IAM visa coordinator when you're ready for your adventure or already on one and would like some assistance. Travelers will have to continue to wear masks when flying commercially and in other transportation hubs, including on buses, ferries, and subways. The U.S. Transportation Security Administration will once again extend its face mask requirement. However, the agency also stated it is working with the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention on a framework moving forward, possibly signaling a future end to the mandate. The new order extends the requirement through the 18th of April 2022. The order has since been extended several times, with the most recent extension set to expire on the 18th of March 2022. The extension of the mandate comes as airlines are expecting a surge in spring travel. The emergence of the Omicron variant just after Thanksgiving dampened demand for flights, but carriers said they expected bookings to rebound. The extension will apply to all travelers over the age of two, although there are exemptions for those with certain disabilities. The mandate has drawn criticism from some Republican lawmakers, including Senator Roger Wicker, who has lobbied to end the mask requirement. Senator Wicker and 30 other senators sent a letter to President Biden urging him to lift pandemic-related travel restrictions. I am disappointed President Biden has chosen to extend these mandates, yet again, Wicker said in a statement after the announcement. The science does not support this decision. Airlines and travel groups have previously called on the administration to repeal the federal mask mandate for public transportation or provide a clear roadmap to remove the mask mandate within 90 days. The mask requirements have resulted in significant friction on U.S. airplanes. The Federal Aviation Administration says since January 2021, there have been a record of 6,800 unruly passenger incidents reported, and 70% involved masking rules. Do you agree with the extended mask mandate? Talk to us in the comments section below. If you have plans to travel, check out the deals we have found in the description box below. If you need assistance with a visa to Europe, the UK, or the US, including help with securing your travel arrangements, I am can help. For visa advice, contact your IAM visa coordinator. If you'd like to get more info on travel, visas, immigration, and citizenship, head over to immigrationandmigration.com for more free content. Don't forget to subscribe. And hit that bell for more travel and visa updates.